First of all, I would like to thank everybody for coming here on this day, showing your solidarity with your brothers and sisters in Syria. Being an Assyrian, by the way, of Christian descent, it is rejectable for me to call us a minority. We are one people, have always been one people. There is no minority and majority in Syria. We are one people. Absolutely, this is the truth. Throughout the history of Syria, we've lived together as brothers and sisters, regardless of faith, regardless of religion, regardless of ethnicity, whether you were Muslim or Christian or Druze or Alawi or Orthodox or Protestant or Sunni or Assyrian or Kurd or Arab, it did not matter. We lived together in peace and harmony. This is the history of Syria. You cannot, you cannot build the future of Syria without looking at the past and history of Syria and looking at the oneness of the people of Syria and the way we've lived together in peace and harmony because the future of Syria is the same as the past of Syria. This is the chant we've heard from day one. This is what we want. We want to build a Syria, a future, a Syria that is a civil democratic state that gives freedom to all of its people, that recognizes all of its groups, regardless of faith and ethnicity. It does not matter. Regardless of how they believe, it doesn't matter for us. We want them to be recognized as people, to know that you can say anything you want against the future government without having the fear of going to prison and being tortured. We want them to know that regardless of who you are, no one will be marginalized anymore. No, no matter what, whether you're male or female, it doesn't matter. You will be one. You can speak all your, your mind. No one is going to tell you what you th should think or say. This is the future of Syria. The Syria that we want to put our hands together. And today, when you hear that no, minorities do not get involved. Absolutely not true. We, as Assyrians, I am a member of the Assyrian Democratic Organization, have been protesting from day one, being arrested and tortured. My brothers and sisters right now are in prison. It doesn't matter. We've been there. We will continue to be there. And today, they're still protesting. Kurds have been protesting. Assyrians have been protesting. Muslims have been protesting. Christians have been protesting. Druze have been protesting. Alawites have been protesting. It does not matter. They've been in this. They put their hands together. This is a revolution, not a civil war. We don't have a civil war in Syria. It is a regime against the people. There hasn't been a civil war. There is two sects in Syria, the regime and the people of Syria. These are the people of Syria. There are two sects only. That's the regime and that is the, the Syrian people who have put their hands together. That's who we are. We don't have different sects. We don't have different uh, denominations. We have one Syrian people who are revolting against a tyrant dictatorship regime. And one more thing, our sisters who have been protesting, our sisters in Syria who have been protesting and today we see them in the refugee camps. They are refugees. They should not be treated as an item to look, be looked at for marriage. No, we don't accept that. They are sisters who should be honored. They are honored. We will honor them. They This is who we should look at them as. They are free Syrian refugees. Absolutely. Absolutely. One more word for my brothers from Iran who are protesting against the tyrant regime of Iran and the dictatorship of Iran. On September 26th, the dictator Ahmadinejad will be coming to New York City. There will be a major protest in New York City against them. Syrians and Iranians are joining together in that protest. We want you all to be there. We need you to protest against that tyrant dictator 
By the way, what's happening in Syria, it's because of that tyrant dictator in Iran. Long live the Syrian people. Long live the revolutionaries of Syria. Our condolences to all the martyrs of Syria. We hope those who have been injured a free and a speedy recovery and freedom to Syria. Allah Suriya Hurriya Bas. Freedom to Syria. Takbir. Free, free.